no bully beef has vegetable protein in it what about bologna what about salami Vienna's Russians processed meats M sandwich M. this question forms part of the frequently asked question playlist on my youtube channel if you see this on tiktok please subscribe to my youtube channel you click on the photo profile and find my blog link carnivalway.blogspot.com and you'll find the youtube triangle just click it and subscribe uh, if you see this on youtube um, please follow me on tiktok the description or the link to that would be in the description of this video This video will also end up on my blog. I'm going to put my frequently asked questions um, on my blog as well. And I will number them there as well to refer to them in future on TikTok. I get a lot of the same questions. So to answer about, um, to answer your question about processed meat, you must always read the label. Uh, read the label because um, you'll see that there are gluten in processed meat, especially Viana's, um, and in things like bologna, there's a lot of uh, MSG and sugar, added sugar, and plant protein, and emulsifiers, and seed oils. Those are the six things that you should look out for. The emulsifiers causes gut permeability. Go to video number 60 on my blog and learn about that. Gluten also causes gut permeability. Among many other things that it is known to cause trouble with. On the carnivore diet, we don't want to consume any of those products. I will mention them again. Gluten seed oils Sun, it can be sunflower canola or any type of seed oil you get you basically get uh, two types of oil you get saturated uh, fat oil and unsaturated fat oil um, things like palm oil and things like pure olive oil is saturated um, also Coconut oil is a pure or um, saturated fat oil. The trouble with coconut oil is that they put sometimes put emulsifiers in it. And they don't say emulsifiers on the label. You must look out for words like E344. Then you know it's an emulsifier. Not good for you. So sugar. Uh, I've mentioned gluca, uh, gluten, I've mentioned seed oils, any form of sugar. It can be uh, artificial uh, sugars like um, sucralose, acesulfame, um, aspartam. It's a bad idea to use it. And then any kind of plant protein. You could say plant protein or soya. Don't use it. I'm not going to go in detail into this video why those things are bad for you. Emulsifiers and preservatives. Here's the point. If you look at the price per kilo that you are paying for processed meat like Viana's, work it out. You'll see that it costs you the same as cheap real meat. I buy currently in 2022, January the 7th, I buy sea bread club steaks for 90 rand 50 per kilo at Waldkorn Nabun Spread. Go and look what a pack of Vienna's is per kilo, the price, and you'll see it's very much in that line. So you, you pay a similar price for inferior product. Um, 
here's the trouble with all kinds of sausages and I include sausages of um, Boerewors as well go and do yourself a favor go into any grocery store and go to the fridge and pick out any Boerewors uh, pack that you want and read the label you'll see the things that I've mentioned gluten sugar MSG that is the other one that is the seventh thing that you shouldn't uh, have in it uh, MSG is monosodium glutamate and it is bad for you it super excites your cells and it causes your cells to die earlier so that is why when you eat MSG like in a pack of chips for instance which you should not do you can't stop because it super excites your taste buds it's a bad idea and yes the FDA in America did approve it but the FDA in America approved a lot of things through the years if you go and look at the history uh, that they later discovered was wrong for instance they said that unsaturated fats are good for you they used to say that they used to say trans fats are good for you you can eat it they declassify trans fats now as a food they don't say it's a food anymore so sunflower oil um, and canola oil if you overheat it it becomes a trans fat it clogs up your cells you don't want to use it and many of these products use hydrogenated sunflower oil or canola oil in it canola oil is so poisonous if you uh, put it on a plant no insect will eat it it's a natural insect repellent so if you are serious about your carnivore diet you should not eat these processed foods because as I said even if you buy horse or sausage you don't know what is in it many times uh, you'll read flavorant what is in that flavorant anti-caking agents that is the number eight you don't want to eat anti-caking agents google it you'll see how bad anti-caking agents are for you so why do you want to consume substances that was not designed to be in your body why would you put an anti-caking agent or a preservative or emulsifier into your body emulsifiers causes gut permeability go and look at video number 60 on my blog click this photo profile and find my blog carnivoreway.blogspot.com please book me for a carnivore coaching consultation uh, the link to that is on my profile if you, are, you see this on TikTok you can click the photo profile and find my blog link um, the Carnival Way t-shirts uh, are out as well available and the photo of that is on my blog 150 Rand for um, embroidered Carnival Way t-shirt and 180 rand for a printed one my email address is there I'll also put it in the description um, and if you see this on YouTube my TikTok link will be in the description as well as my email address if you want to order um, a t-shirt and then um, please follow me on TikTok Thank you for your support thank you for everybody that subscribed to my youtube channel i've got a frequently asked playlist there as i said and this video forms part of that playlist